Well, exams, they're not only for humans, but they're also for our furry friends. I have Erica Chandler here from the LASPCA. You're joining us to talk about just the importance of a wellness visit. And we have a little friend here. Yes, we do. Thank you for having us. Yes. This is Stumpy. She's one of our uh, adoptables at the LASPCA. But yeah, it's very important uh, for our animal, or animals to have annual exams just the same as we do. So uh, making an appointment with your vet is going to be crucial to maintaining the health of your pet. What kind of information are you learning at these annual visits? Of course, so this is a really good time for you to talk to your vet about anything you may have questions about in regard to your pet. So let's say, you know, maybe there's like a skin irritation you've noticed, it's time to talk about that. You'll go through a physical exam with your vet, um, as well as making sure that you're up to date on all of those important vaccines. One of those vaccines, of course, being the rabies vaccine, which is, you know, a law here in Orleans Parish to have that up to date. But you also want to talk to your vet about um, vaccination plan in general to make sure they're up to date on everything. Now, She's not anxious, it doesn't seem. She's, <laughs> she's having a good time getting her treat, treat game on. <laughs> but if your pet is anxious, some, some pets have anxiety, um, what, any advice you have when you want to yeah. take them to these wellness vets? Of course. You know, what, yeah. if they have anxiety. Yeah, so when your pet is anxious, the best thing to do is tire them out, right? So whether that's taking them on a really long walk or run mm. before you go to the vet, or giving them something like an enrichment activity. An enrichment activity can include a frozen peanut butter Kong that they can gnaw on on their way to the vet, um, or even like a dog puzzle, something like that, that again is going to tire them out, get them more relaxed for when they get to the vet. Um, that, can, that can help you out as well as the staff. It's kind of like <laughs> Like children. You take yeah. them to the park, get them to run around a little bit, and then they, exactly. they're a little more relaxed. Exactly. Okay, so we, you did kind of briefly mention about vaccines. Right. You, that's m one of the main parts of getting of it. Of course. Um, but you, you, the vaccine you have to get, and then there are yeah. other vaccines too. Uh -huh. Exactly. So there are core vaccines for both dogs and cats. For dogs, they're, they're going to prevent against things like parvovirus, which is extremely contagious. You definitely want to make sure you're. Um, you know, vaccinated against that. And then for cats, it could be feline herpes vaccine or virus and stuff like that. So it's really important that you go through with your vet all those core vaccines uh, to get your dog or cat up to date on so that they're happy and healthy and then you stay happy and healthy too. And yeah. obviously you're doing this once a year as your annual checkup. Right. This is just yeah. a great time for you to check in with of the course. vet about your animal. Yeah. And this little puppy here is yes. up for adoption? Yes, she is. This is Stumpy. And she is about two years old. She is like a little bully mix. Yeah, um, she has the cutest yeah, face. I know she does. She has this nice big old head and a cute little body. So yes. that's why we went with Stumpy, <laughs> poor little thing. But she's a, yeah, she's a female. She was found uh, by animal control officers, brought into the shelter, adopted yeah. out. And then our animal control officers found her again. So oh. she's back with us um, and available for adoption again. So we hope the next adopters are going to be the perfect yes. family because she's so sweet and she rides well in the car and she knows sit now which Does is she I'm really proud of her with a treat she'll with a treat sit. okay yeah. we're not she gonna, needs we're motivation not gonna, we're not gonna test her on TV <laughs> right. today all right and if somebody wants to set up their annual appointment how can they do that absolutely so they can either call us um, at 504-368-5191 or they can go online to louisianaspca.org uh, and schedule a visit there as well. All right, so make sure you, just like you need to go to the doctor, make sure you take your vet, yes. your, your pets to the vet. And uh, if you want Stumpy, you want to take Stumpy <laughs> home. Yes. So cute, that cute little face. Uh, <laughs> then, you know, call up to the LASPCA and yes. adopt Stumpy. Thank you, Erica, so much Thank for you. being here. Uh, and we will just send it.